Well, we've had to hit the pause button on a big spring of live events and video productions here in Boston Wrestling Sports due to the coronavirus outbreak. Let's pause and remember the good old days of professional wrestling with New England wrestling history. My Hall of Fame sidekick, Mr. USA, Tony Atlas, is up in Auburn, Maine, itching to get back to work in studio on our Wrestling Insiders video series. We have been able to produce brand new full-length podcast-style episodes of Wrestling Insiders where Tony does what he does best, talk. Our schedule has been a little unpredictable with everything going on in the world. You can check them out on our Facebook and YouTube channels now. Sit back, forget about life's worries, and have a few laughs. We're also producing weekly Flashback Friday videos where we go into the Boston Wrestling Sports Studio Shoot Interview Archives and hear stories from wrestling's greatest legends. Wrestling fans, where were you 40 years ago tonight? The World Wrestling Federation was live in Dover, New Hampshire, Thursday, May the 15th, 1980. The opening contest, Fred Marzino battled Johnny Rods to a draw. Bobby Duncombe defeated Duke of Dorchester Pete Doherty. Larry Zabisco with the win over Rene Goulet. WWF World Champion Bob Backlund retained the title over Jose Estrada. And WWF Intercontinental Champion Ken Patera retained the title in a time limit draw with Pat Patterson. If you were in Dover Live, share your memories in the comment section below. Please like, share, and subscribe so we can bring you more great wrestling content.